Just a quick PSA and another video for, you know, some people that don't watch my YouTube videos, obviously. Um, we've been working on the coupe. The coupe finally starts. If you guys know, back-to-back -back issues, trigger gear falling off, causing a no start. Fuel, pe uh, fuel rail popping off, causing a no start. One day, car wanted to start. I think it's because the fuel rail was actually sitting in correctly. And car started up. And then, um, soon to come find out, threads were completely stripped on the fuel rail. And I was able to wiggle the fuel rail up and down and, you know, force it out. So, we got some helicoil, threaded those in, tapped it, good to go now. Fuel rail holds. But now, we're dealing with a idle surge issue. Uh, I'm not exactly, exactly sure on what it could be. I mean, I didn't really mess with anything besides the fuel rail. But a lot of people are just fucking saying some really ridiculous stuff on what it could be. And I just feel like... Yes, it needs a tune, but how am I going to get a tune when I'm dealing with gaskets getting ripped off, sensors getting ripped off, fuel lines getting, you know, fucking ripped off. I have fuel leaks everywhere. Like, guys, give me some time. Let me get all these little things fixed. Let me get Hondata. And then we could go from there. What's up guys, starting today's video, we have my fiance here helping me, but I want to show you guys this little DIY injector cleaning tool that I got from Amazon, which is about 11 bucks, 12 bucks, and pretty much it comes with a harness that connects to the injector, and then it has a power and ground, and we're using our battery pack right here to um, pretty much ground it out, and we have Gina right here to tap onto the power to have the injector spray. So I did three of them already. This is going to be the last one we're going to do a couple times. And um, for sure, the other three are definitely clean. The spray pattern is a lot better. So we're about to do this one real quick. And I'm going to show you guys how it works. If I get a good angle. I'm going to put my phone right here. Hold on, I'm going to go lower. Go ahead. And that's pretty much it. Shout out to the fiance helping me do this because it's kind of hard adding pressure, putting this in and taking it out. But yeah, it really stinks. But that's $10. Oh, oh. <coughs> is that what I get, did I get on you? My toe. Sorry. But this brake cleaner is like five bucks. The kit itself is like 10 bucks. Don't forget to turn it off. So you're good, you can just drop it. But overall this whole kit right here is you know fairly cheap gear injectors clean for really cheap and if you guys want to do it do it yourself this is definitely a good investment for your cleaning inject injectors so if you guys are planning on doing some self cleaning injectors this is definitely the kit to go i'm gonna leave the link of the amazon in the description so you guys can go check that out so hope you guys enjoyed today's video showing you guys this little DIY trick that I've seen on YouTube. And uh, hope you guys enjoy um, using this if you guys do get it. And I'm out. Peace.